Hi friends, this is your Vetrigal. Um, today I will teach how to create a sub report in a crystal report. Okay, first time I am try to add a one report for crystal create a crystal report. So first click add and new item. In new item report section, I am selecting crystal report. Here I am uh, typing a report name is main and click add. So I am choosing the blank report and click OK. OK. Inside the sub inside the main report, I have the uh, header section and the header footer, uh, report header and report footer, page header and page footer and detail sections. So I need to create a sub report for that. So I need to create a sub report in detail section. So right click first insert new and insert and click the sub report so i am choosing the sub report so you have two options you want to create a new sub report new report inside a sub report or else you have to exiting report you have to add a exiting report into a uh, sub report uh, so first i am choosing exiting report i have here uh, three uh, exiting report is there one is form 1a and form 1 and form 2 report is there so I am choosing exiting report and browse reports and choosing I am mm, form one report and click OK and OK. So what we do the form one report doesn't change but the form one report copy will included in main report so you want to you change any uh, sub report like you have to go to edit sub report the form one report it will be showing in uh, main report inside a main report you will see the form one report now i am trying to edit something is form and save so you have to see form one report it doesn't change see so the what the meaning is uh, you using the uh, sub report you uh, sub report uh, and call the form one report in a sub report At that time uh, sub report won't change the actual main report so you have to change anything it will change in main report only so it's a copy of the uh, form one report here so i am closing the form one report and main report I have the three two reports one is main report so this is main section so just I'm adding main this is um, sub report in print preview you will see this is a sub report so why it comes second page because the sub report length uh, exiting the main report length so that's why it comes to second report so what I'm do I need to uh, delete those things just select delete 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 so First time click and to fix the section. So this is my form one report. This is a sub report and save. Now I am go to main report and click print preview. It will see inside a main report. This is a sub report. Okay. So you double click in preview you double click the sub report it will only showing the sub report only so double click the sub report it will showing the sub report only so you want to go to the main report and click the main report here so okay now what i teach so this is sub report you will see the some border is there so how to remove the border First, I'm go to the main report edit section and right click format object uh, in border you have to choose none and none and none and click OK. 
now we have to preview is working like a main report is a sub report okay so this is the method to create a uh, sub report okay you want to edit the sub report just you have to click the here you can edit or else you right click and edit sub report it you can edit so now i will teach how to pass the parameter how to pass the parameter main report report to sub report main report to sub report so first i am creating one parameter here first i am creating one parameter here parameter my parameter name is id is a string value static and click just ok so ok and another parameter name ok now right click change click change sub report links here you will see the parameter id just add into parameter id and name ok just and click ok so you will go to the uh, sub report now you will see the sorry I mean main report right click edit sub report links report field and name report field id id and click ok inside parameter you doesn't changing because you need to uh, create a parameter for same thing id here this is string this is parameter and name here parameter go to main report and a format object sorry change the sub report links you dear doesn't uh, included so now I'm executing the program and refresh the program so first I'm saving the data and main report parameter is not asking right okay now change the parameter here parameter field I am choosing parameter field and name I am choosing name field and ok main report I have the parameter name is asking the enter the id id is 1 2 and name is and click ok so so you will see the id is 1 2 and name so uh, what i am do i am creating the parameter for main report and after that i am passing the parameter values into sub report so uh, change the links you will see it passing the parameter so main parameter it will distributed into uh, sub report so i am just changing edit sub report and delete this record and put two sections so what is id and name of the candidate so name id 
so I put the records like that here and control S and go to main report and sorry 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 I didn't run because I click the main report and refresh the sections so using current parameter values I promote new parameter values and I am changing to values 2014 to 001 and name equal to I directory where and click OK so ideas so like that you can use change a parameter or anything in sub report same wise you can add some database field also in database expert and I have some database sections and student register and click OK so and after that I am passing the details to here here just date and address control s so i go to and preview we will once because i'm using the uh, this is data set sections so data section i uh, once execute the program then only it will come so i remove the data set sections and add to through database driving DOB tables okay same thing I am just recession number put the recession number track the recession number here and recession date here delete and delete control S and main view you will get those details so it is a big word expand those things control s main report so you will get the recession number date something so you can because i'm putting the these details into uh, detail section now so inside a detail section i put the this also detail sections so the detail section the record is exiting two times then it will be comes two times in the record so first section and second sections okay guys i am exp explaining the small concept meanwhile these this concept you have any doubts and queries then just feel free to mail me i will uh, explain to uh, after that i will give the best examples i try to developing the best example for example for the sub report and i will post it as soon as possible okay guys we will meet our next